Hey, it's Donnie Walker here. Wow, it's Saturday. Uh, felt kind of bad. I didn't do my TGIF video yesterday. I always do one on Friday. I <clears throat> Anyways, I'm in Nanaimo. Um, just came down to the Walker Saw Shop today, pick up some more saws. And so I got all of them here. Three 390s, 562, uh, 572, 592, a 661, a 261, and a 500i over there. While I was there, there was an old 2100 laying on the bench, and I was like, where the heck do you get this thing from? <clears throat> and uh, my brother Johnny said, uh, oh, I don't know. I don't want nothing to do with it, though. It looks kind of beat up, but it's actually not bad. It's an old 2100 my dad built years ago for the race saw. Um, here's the carburetor on it. It's off an 084 that's been bored out. Okay. You know, he built a custom intake for it out of aluminum with a phenolic kind of spacer in between and uh done some porting to it i actually don't think my dad actually ported this saw uh, to me it's it's not his work he he does a lot better finishing and and, and he wouldn't have done the um, transfers like this especially on the crankcase here as someone has tried to port match the crankcase look how thin it is on this side here there's really nothing to to, to seal it eh so the fellow wants me to restore this. He's got the pipe at home, the tune pipe for it, and he's gonna bring down to me. It's just, it's just weird that he um, brought this to the sh shop there, because I remember this at the Powell River Logger Sports. I remember seeing this saw and going, hey, it looks like one of my dad's old saws, but I, I really don't think it is. He might originally built it, and someone maybe did a, some more work to it, okay? Um, so yeah, I'm gonna restore it. Um, I don't know when I get the time as long as with the, all the other stuff that I do. Here's the old L65 that I need to get back to my friend uh, Jamie Coles tomorrow. That was his uh, family saw that kept his house warm for, for years. I told you guys that I think a couple videos ago. So I just cleaned it up. Uh, just enough, got all the rust out the bar and chain, painted the, the um, muffler. The piston looked like brand new in this thing. I'm not kidding you. It looks perfect shape. These are great old saws. No really anti-vibe on it, but they didn't really vibrate much. Just had a good balanced crankshaft. So I just did this for him for free, just to, because I knew his grandfather and his family and himself, just doing him a nice jester. Oh yeah, so yeah, and I found uh, one of my go-kart pipes, direct drive pipes. I might utilize this pipe onto one of my racing saws that I'm gonna have built. Next week, I'm really gonna get on the program of building the, building the hot saws. Um, I got lots sitting there kind of apart, so I'm going to build a couple 3120s out of parts with pipes, with big carbs, <clears throat> and try to finish my McCullough 101 off with the big uh, HS carburetor, or HL carburetor. So uh, I actually even got a manifold. My dad gave me another engine with uh, two carbs on it, so if I can find the right setup to run the throttle, I might do that as well. So yeah. Just at the beach house in Nanaimo, waiting for my friend Jerry Patterson to get back. He was at the go-kart practice today. I didn't go today, but I will be going tomorrow to uh, help do the teching there and uh, help him out with his, his go-kart. I didn't take mine this weekend. I knew it was going to pee down rain, and it's going to rain a lot tomorrow. So, you know, when I was younger, I would do it, but eh, I'm too old now to get wet and cold all day. But if I was in the championship, it's the last race today for the winter series. Can you believe that? We have a winter's go-kart series in Canada here. I think we're the only province that has one but uh you never know we get nice days sometimes right last year we had a couple of beautiful days in racing in the winter but i'll get my cart ready that i just got the other night down in victoria and i'm going to take the hond off and put a briggs on it and uh, be out there playing with my friends again so we'll see that next time anyways have a great weekend saturday night live tonight eh? keep your saw in the wood sticking ice rubber in the road have a great day bye now